Spring is right around the corner and I'm still hoping for better weather. Maybe thinking about vacation, somewhere warm, somewhere tropical, somewhere where there isn't snow. Are you thinking about going on vacation? If so, stay tuned. Welcome back everyone to Coffee with Cody. Today I am drinking a matcha latte from Dunkin' Donuts. Uh, it's a new product of theirs and I really like it. Um, my mother said it kind of tastes like grass. I might agree with her, but I really like the flavor. So if you haven't been to Dunkin' Donuts and tried their matcha latte, you definitely should. Anyway, that is not the reason why you're here. The reason you're here is to watch my tip of the week and we are talking about going on vacation and getting a rental car. Big shout out to my colleagues, Tiffany and Chelsea. They brought this topic up to me during our service team meeting and I thought it was a wonderful idea for today's Coffee with Cody. Our office, and I'm sure many other insurance offices, get asked the question, do we need to purchase the insurance through the rental car company when renting a car? Now, if you're fully covered, meaning you carry comprehensive and collision, then technically, no, you don't need to purchase the insurance through the rental car company. However, if you're only carrying liability, then yes, we highly recommend that you purchase the insurance through the rental car company. If you carry collision and comprehensive, then even though you don't need to purchase it, we highly recommend that you do. And here's why. First reason, if for some reason you were to get into an accident with the rental car and the rental company could no longer use that vehicle, it's called loss of use. And that unfortunately would not be covered under your personal auto policy. Just like the cost of renting a car, that amount could really add up depending on how many days it takes for the auto repair company to fix that rental car. Second reason, rental car companies can put a hold on your credit card for deductibles, for anticipated loss of use, for many things, which could be really problematic when you're on vacation. And our third reason, peace of mind for you when you're on vacation. If you were to get into an accident, there's no hassle, no paperwork, the car is returned to the rental car company, they take care of it, and you're given a new car to enjoy the rest of your vacation. For many of my colleagues, this question comes up a lot, and I'm sure it does for many other agencies. If you're going on vacation soon, save yourself the hassle and purchase a policy through the rental company. Thank you so much for joining me for Coffee with Cody on this Thirsty Thursday and enjoy the rest of your week. Cheers, everyone.